I'm gonna give you some Christmas gift ideas that don't suck like the ones you normally get or the ones you normally give that look something like this. They can look something like this. Let's see what all this is about. I am in the festive spirit, as you can see. They're just things that I know that golfers will benefit from. Some of them are free, some of them are a little bit more expensive, and some of them are just cheap, good fun. So let's get into it. Now, these are not in any order of priority, okay? Um, but I'm just gonna go through them. I'm gonna reel them off quickly, that's it. First up is the stuff from Watson Golf, okay? You may well have seen the hanger before, all right? This is a device that you attach to your club and it's gonna really help the wrist angles and create, you know, just the right sort of neutral kind of arm movement and path to deliver the club a little bit easier. Now, the other one they have is called the structure ball, all right? Now, this enabling you to sort of keep your arms together a little bit, all right? And that's the idea, and you can hit shots with it. Uh, it's lightweight, but it's sort of arced and shaped, so you can actually sort of slot your arms in quite nicely here. So it works very easily to develop a swing that just sort of feels, you know, connected, where we're not allowing the arms to sort of disconnect a little bit too much, okay? All you have to do is give a bit of love to the golfer in your life. Do it for someone, give a little. These massage guns are fantastic just to get any knots out of yourself, uh, just to loosen up the body before a round or even take it out on the golf cart with you, which is something I do. The next one is this wonderful little device from Fi Golf, okay? This is a cheap thing to use. Um, it's under a couple hundred bucks and I've done a video on it. We had some fun with the kids. I think it was like last winter actually, but it actually has a simulator and it comes with a little device that you can basically you attach to this or you can actually attach to real golf clubs. This is more like a weighted thing and you can sort of hear it clip, uh, but you can attach it to, you know, golf clubs and make full swings as long as your seating allows but you can it goes on your phone or your ipad just through an app and you can even play golf courses and practice range and just sort of cast it to a tv screen or projector even if you have one of those so yeah really good device here seeing as we're on the subject of simulators you might have noticed we have a new kind of studio here actually moved home uh in the late summer and just got this room together thanks to Shop Indoor Golf and you can check them out below. Here's a bit of a silly one. Get the golfer in your life an old golf club, all right? If you have any idea how long they've been playing or what clubs they used to love, even better. But you can just go on eBay or, you know, I think I got this from some flea market for like 22 bucks or something. And this was one of the most premium clubs of its day. And I got it used, uh, you know, second hand. It was like the first driver I got. And I was like maybe 17, 18, something like this. And I loved it, all right? Um, a fantastic club. And there was the Great Big Bertha, which was, you know, the, the sort of real step up. But this is a fun one. But tailor-made bubble, even old persimmon woods, anything like that. You can get them cheap, but it's a fun gift. And... It, it's enjoyable to play golf when you're swinging with these things because it evokes memories, it evokes good swings, you know? It's just different era. And anything that gives a bit of nostalgia and it actually helps your game, okay? So now there's a, a company, um, Stuart Sink has been using this, it's AI Golf and a few other tour pros, but I've played around with this uh, a little bit and it's called the Gatekeeper and it really does help uh, tempo, path, and things like this, good. So it's a good way to focus, practice your putting instead of just mindlessly hitting stroke after stroke. Uh, also, um, my friend Andy Gorman has a couple of brilliant training aids. Check those out in the link below and you can sort of see an image here, hopefully that I'll put up. Yeah, and work on your putting. Sticking with the short game, the same company, AI Golf, they've got these towels, okay? They call them towel 2.0s, and there's a couple of different ones. There's one for alignment, and there's one for basically um, target practice. 
and they come in different shapes and it you know they're very durable but they're obviously transportable but this is going to help your path your ball position and various things like that um, and there's lots of different sort of markings i am going to go over this uh, you know these things in, a, in the fu a future video basically but I just wanted to show you and you can check it out with some links below but these are really neat to practice indoors or outdoors or whatever so I showed you cleaning the golf clubs earlier now you might notice they're Ben Hogan Ben Hogan are fantastic and the reason that I partner with them is because they cut out the middleman they're not paying fortunes for advertising whatever it might be they're going straight to you um, which gives you the savings but this is very high quality solid equipment and now we are on to the rangefinder okay and for this I'm going to take us back out onto the golf course um, it's spot on it has slope detector it has different modes so you can see different things within the uh, sort of visual here um, it's just basically very simple and that's why I love it uh, yeah as well as the the way it's sort of connected to your bag and the packaging and everything this is just a really solid very easy to use kind of device um, and it's a hundred like yeah really accurate as well I compared it to a lot more expensive uh, I love it it's affordable and in comparison to a lot of the sort of more popular brands this is a solid rangefinder with some cool little but simple features you want to give the loved one some practice indoors then the almost golf balls could be your answer all right they're they're sort of foam but really kind of dense foam so they sort of feel like real golf balls hence you know the name of almost golf balls and there's a few different sort of brands of them some a little bit more cheaper some a bit more expensive i've checked a couple of them out no real difference between any of them but yeah they work great they can work pretty well on a simulator up to a, a, a certain point but if you don't want to make as much noise or you're worried about hitting various things and you can even just hit them into pillows and things especially with chipping and stuff like that um, but yeah cheap good use can be used outside we indoors have whatever some glow in the dark golf balls that activate when you strike them you know we've got a different blue we got red i think this one's a green one i think we had earlier yeah there's a green one here so yeah these things are really pretty cool cheap good fun good for twilight golf whatever you want for them but yeah glow in the dark golf balls they're not exactly pro v ones but you can see them fly for you know quite a long way pretty good fun you know, a low investment right the total golf trainer again is several sort of training aids in one there's different attachments different features um, and i've got a video on it we've covered it before so i will link that below but you know the cues that you're looking for to get a better golf swing and um, yeah it's a wonderful thing easy to use very durable and affordable what's not to like check it out below if you've been following me for a while you may have noticed that i don't really wear a glove that much in any of my videos and that's because i don't actually play with a glove not never but very rarely it's just something i've never really gotten into the habit of just sort of got used to it however there is a glove that i've discovered and it is the claw glove okay this is a really neat piece of kit it's very different to a lot of you know the main sort of brands out there but it is so well built and such a good price and that's why i'm sharing it with you um, what it has hopefully you can sort of see what it has it has this kind of texture on it it's so, so it's very grippy very grippy but stretchy durable and it just feels good like it doesn't really feel like you've got uh anything problematic on your hand it just feels comfortable but the grip is, is very like non-slip it's wonderful so you can check those out below all right final training aid okay the lag shot trainer now there is uh, another version g-force which you'll see is a white shaft and i'll put a link below that as well they have a putter um, they have wedges and they're sort of best maybe for england europe that way but the lag shot here with the blue shaft okay pretty much they're the same thing um, it's just a bit easier to get them if you're in the US 
but this helps your tempo yes it helps your lag but it really helps slow the swing down and you or the golfer in your life probably have too much of a kind of snatchy golf swing so what this does it enables you and it's kind of encourages you rather than forces you to wait for the club at the top of the backswing so you can see it's sort of flexing and catching up and now we have to sort of wait for it to come back down trust me this is a good training aid it's a good gift and you can hit shots with it that's the idea you can actually hit shots with it to kind of get the tempo that you want all right flex is here and if it's bending too much that club face is going to stay open so you have to sort of allow and wait for it if you rush it it's going to sort of overhook that way and close if you try and if you keep that face open it's going to exaggerate it so everything's going to be exaggerated so it's going to help your strike quality squaring the club face up and your tempo pretty good things from just one golf club and it comes in driver and wedges as well well there we have it my friends merry christmas to one and all obviously you're going to see me before then but here's some ideas that i hope you're going to enjoy and yeah it's not conclusive it's not the only gifts you need to get people but just a few fun ideas and i hope you're gonna get one or two of them for the golfers or even yourself to have a nice festive season cheers <laughs>